Hey YouTube, another fun guns video for you. Uh, these are two of my all-time favorite guns in my collection. The Beretta Minx in 22 short and the Beretta Model 20 in 22 or excuse me, in 25 ACP. This was the precursor to the Beretta Model 21A, which is in 22 long rifle. A lot of people don't know before they made it in 22 long rifle, they made it in 25 ACP. Only produced for 2 years. Um, I've got one here um, in the original box. Uh, it's got the original paperwork in there. Kind of a fun one. Uh, we'll talk about each of these here in just a second, but let's talk about the Minx a little bit first. Uh, the Breda Minx is um, a very, very fun gun. Teeny, teeny, tiny. Uh, I mean, this fits in my, I have medium sized hands, it disappears in my hand. Um, it's 22 short, so it's an absolute joy to shoot. Um, no recoil. <laughs> uh, you know, it's kind of like shooting a cap gun, so it's a lot of fun for me. I feel like a little kid every time I shoot it. Um, it is a tip-up barrel design, kind of like the 21A. So it's, you just flip that, tip-up barrel, so you can load around in the barrel, load the magazine, you don't have to rack the slide. So great gun for a kid to learn on or for um, a woman to handle because you don't have to rack the slide um, in order to get around in the chamber. But it's a really fun gun. You know, I'm a big James Bond fan, and he carried a Beretta before he carried the PPK, and wasn't the same Beretta. It was a Beretta in 25, but it was not the Model 20 over here. But uh, these are just fun to shoot, fun to carry. Um, I do carry them occasionally just for fun. Um, this one in 22 short. Not going to give you a lot of stopping power, but kind of fun to carry, especially as a backup. Um, this one here, the Beretta Model 20, similar in size. It's a little bit thicker. Uh, compared with the bread of minks. Again, this one's in 25 ACP. Also the tip-up barrel. Um, this one has a safety where my bread of minks does not. They did make some bread of minks with safeties, but mine does not have one. Um, it does have a safety there. Like I said, thicker, so you can get a little bit better grip on it. Um, but this one, because it's in 25 ACP, is really no fun to shoot, in my opinion. Pretty snappy. Beats you up after a couple of magazines, you'll be ready to switch to something else. But um, kind of a cool piece of history because there weren't a whole lot of these. Has only made it for two years, and um, the 21A obviously was a huge success. But the Model 20, which came before it, was kind of a flop. So kind of fun to have one. I think I picked this one up for 150 or 200 dollars um, in the box, like I said. So kind of a kind of a cool one. You don't see them that often. So when I saw it, I kind of had to grab it, but. Um, the bread of minks in 22 short. They also made this one in, I think they made it in 25 also, but um, yeah, just a super fun gun. A lot of fun, teeny tiny. Um, real small sights on there. Like I said, no safety. It's got the European kind of mag release. Both of them do in the same spot down here, which is a little bit awkward, but just a beautiful, beautiful gun and a lot of fun to shoot. This one's one of my favorite ones to take to the range. So, Anyway guys, if you don't have any little Breda Mouse guns, I recommend them. They're a lot of fun. And like I said, you kind of feel like a kid or like a, you know, like a spy or secret agent when you're carrying one of these around. And taking them to the range is always a lot of fun. So, Anyway, thanks for watching guys. Take care. God bless.